Here we are with the Bewitched Hands. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. It's, uh, it's not very often we get French bands coming through Austin, Texas, or the entire country for that matter. So this is very, very cool. We're excited to have you in. So I'll start out by thanking you for some things you've done. Thanks for the Statue of Liberty. Appreciate that. Thanks for helping us get our independence. I'm still grateful for that. And uh, thanks for the best sporting event in the world, the Tour de France. I absolutely love it, and I'm glued to it for three weeks, so I feel like I know your country a little bit. But uh, every description I saw, read about you, describes you as psychedelic. 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 And what qualifies something as psychedelic? Is it the harmonies? Is it effects on the guitars? I guess, in fact, it was more in the beginning of the band. At the beginning, three years ago, we played more psychedelic sound, but uh, now it's more, it's more pop music. But I guess uh, the psychedelic thing, it's more the guitar and the, uh, and the vocals. But um, it was, yes, yeah, it was uh, three years ago, it was more like this. Mm. In the yeah. beginning, it was uh, also with um, the structure of the songs, uh, with, with um, passage, in, you know, um, instrumental passages and... Uh, really long which, songs. Uh, mm. Um, something which uh, lasts a little and uh, goes. Uh, <laughs> difficult to, uh, to understand, but okay. to um, the tempo changes. To, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. You're, I, I understand the a couple years ago there were twice as many in the band. Yeah, yeah. we were ten. Why did you scale it down? Why go smaller? Because it was a bit hard to travel. <laughs> in the, in the van, and, yeah, we, we need two vans, it was too complicated, so now we are six, it's a good, uh, good f for good me, number. good number. Okay, um, in, in one interview that I read about you guys, you all had what you described as serious projects that you were doing elsewhere, Be and this yeah. you described as a creative project, yeah. and now it's become, I assume, your main yeah. project. What's the difference between a creative and a serious project? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the difference is... Uh, in the beginning of the band, uh, it was uh, some kind of uh, recreative uh, project. Uh, as um, We all wanted to sing uh, all together uh, and play in the bars and it was not totally serious. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, the others are, uh, were um, serious in the in the way we. The jeu, je te suis plus. Je te suis plus. C'était quoi la question? Il dit c'est moins difficile. Différence entre un projet, projet sérieux, sérieux et un projet euh, pas sérieux. Euh, I don't really know. It's just, <laughs> okay. it's just natural. When we start to play together, it was natural. It works. It works mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. So didn't ask the question. We just played together, and, uh, we d and uh, the solo project we had before, we just stopped to all these projects to to be just uh, in the be rich tense. Okay. So. One last question: When you write a song in English and you're working out the lyrics, do you have a native a dictionary? <laughs> 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 Do you, do you take it to a, 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 a native English speaker, you know, whether they're American or English or what, and, and say, does this phrase make sense? Do you, do you bounce you it have, off You have to tell me. No. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense for you. <laughs> but do you, or do you just kind of know that it, yeah, I mean. Uh, for the lyrics, we use the lyrics like an instrument, so it's a bit different. We, we record the music before and after, we put music, uh, lyrics yeah. on the music to create an, an ambience. More like, it's more like this, we don't try to tell a story, a love story or something like that. It's, uh, we are, it's not our mother language, or our main language, so for us, in English, it's a language for rock and pop music, so mm -hmm. we didn't want to sing in French. It didn't work, I guess. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, thanks for coming in. Your songs uh, just make people want to sing along, yeah. which probably happens in live shows, yes? Yeah. As the crowd starts singing, yeah. it has that effect. It's really magical. So thank you very much thank for you. coming in. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs>